What's up guys and Galaxy Z Fold 3 is getting hotter. As we are passing this year 2021, the foldable Z lineup making headlines in the news. No doubt Galaxy Z Fold 2 was a huge upgrade over the original Galaxy Fold, but something still missing here which is about to coming with the Z Fold 3. With the original Galaxy Fold, Samsung hasn't paid any much attention to its design. It had a very tiny small cover display, which then resolved with Z Fold 2 by putting bigger display crushing the huge thick bezels. But it was a long narrow display with an aspect ratio of 25 by 9 yeah, pretty weird and since it's Android, some applications don't use full display and left the black borders. But according to a new report coming straight from South Korea reveals, Samsung is changing the dimensions of Galaxy Z Fold 3 for a better. According to a report, there will be almost zero bezels on both the inner and outer displays and to make the cover screen wider, Samsung is apparently decreasing the size of main foldable display. The main display shrinking down to 7.5 inches while the cover display shrinking down to 6.1 inches. That's not a big major difference. But to make cover screen wider, Samsung is making another compromise which is in the battery department. The report also reveals that because of the smaller screen size, we won't be getting a 4500mAh cell instead, we'll see a 4380mAh battery under the hood. But because of new processors Snapdragon 888 and Exynos 2100 and their 5 nanometer process efficiencies, we won't see that much of a difference in overall battery life. Plus, there will be a polymer-free OLED displays on the Galaxy Z Fold 3, which overall consume less power. And then we could also expect under-display camera technology with the Galaxy Z Fold 3, 120Hz on both displays, and finally, pro-level ultra cameras on $2000 Samsung's Galaxy Z Fold 3. Still, a lot of things have left, firmware development has begun of both foldables, and we could see the launch happening in the month of July. So do let me know what you think. Subscribe to the channel if you are new here and I'll catch you in the next one.